हरि ओम ओम श्री गणेशाय नम ओम श्री सरस्वत नम ओम श्री गुरुभ्यो नम ओम श्री चिन्मय सद्गुरव नम साष्टांग प्रणाम से द लोटस स्वीट ऑफ पूज्य गुरु जी माय डियर स्वात्मानंद जी वो सच अ ब्यूटिफुल पोएम दैट यू कंपोज इट फिल्स अवर हार्ट विथ सच ग्रेट डिलाइट एंड वेरी वेरी इंस्पिरेशनल टू सी ऑल द वेरियस यू नो वे प्रोग्राम्स अंडरटेकन फॉर द हनर एंड नीथ दियर एंड with such great inspiration every one of us every one of you i should say because we seeing after i have come i am seeing here you know lot and lots of all of you coming together for this very very wonderful occasion and that for the 108th jayanti we are doing it on a sunday so that all of us can come so swam ji very very happy to see so many inspired and inspirational activities being taken up on it's such a huge inspiration for the whole of chinmay mission also and that we are able to do it right here at the very first ashram established by pujya gurudev and that also our students of sandipni are also able to witness so and participate so all these adds a lot of value mm-hmm. thank you swami ji very much i'm sure all of us would have listened to this beautiful you know anecdote of gurudev which which comes through in so many forms that somebody went and asked gurudev went and told gurudev with great happiness and joy and pride i have gone through the bhagavad gita 108 times you must have heard this right all of us and then gurudev is supposed to have remarked very uh, very mischievously as the guru as the bhagavad gita gone through you at least once you know that you know it's a very 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 interesting question which gurudev asked not able to hear okay hari <coughs> om okay maybe so echo is there okay any of they will manage to the best of the extent possible let us know so you see that that remark of gurudev is a very very uh, very poignant remark because what gurudev wants to tell us is that knowledge should become part and parcel of us after composing the entire uh, bhagavad gita you all know that bhagavan veda vyasa presents the bhagavad gita in the mahabharata then afterwards there is a very beautiful line which bhagavan veda vyasa writes he says gita sugita kartavya now i think uh, gita sugita kartavya meaning that bhagavad gita becomes sugita and that is kartavya you please do it meaning i have presented the bhagavad gita of bhagavan shri krishna as you know vyase na gratitam purana munina i have presented i have done my job now what is your job gita sugita kartavya you make gita bhagavad gita part and parcel of your life that you be the expression of bhagavad gita that bhagavad gita be not a text somewhere let your life be the visible bhagavad gita now this is one task pujya gurudev gave for all of us you all know some of you when i see you here i know that you know not even half the age of you all hmm? but but you have listened to pujya gurudev so many times so many occasions and we all remember that at the end gurudev would only say this every day you study every day you that that was pujya gurudev's wish that that this knowledge becomes part and parcel of each one of us so let that task always continue for all of us 
one thing more also when i just you know as we keep sir guru serving guru dev and we take sub certain projects as guided by by earlier by pooja guru ji and now by pooja swami ji when we take up various projects we really see the beauty and mahima and glory of pooja guru dev you know as you know wherever we go you know sometimes you know we go uh, sometimes for some activities we know go, have to go to a higher level also in the sometimes you know for example the chinmaya vishwavidyalaya beat we have to go to the government of india and for certain some projects of cif also we have to go to some universities for a mou so many things and then we always when we go there we are surprised i was surprised for so many times and they say oh you are coming from chinmaya mission i have listened to gurudev not that they say gurudev i have listened to swami chinmayananda when i was a small child i listened he came to our school he addressed us in the college you know and that person who is sitting there is a registrar of the university and that person is a, a secretary of that department and then you know things go on very very fast very smooth and then things all get accomplished in tamil we have a nice proverb yaanai varum pinne mani osai varum munne the elephant comes only later it's the sound of its bell comes before i always feel that gurudev has done so much for us and made it so comfortable and easy and that brand value chinmaya is so powerful and remember when i say brand value chinmaya i also mean that brand value chinmaya established by all our devotees who served gurudev each generation needs to add more value to that pujya gurudev pujya guruji used to always say you will see gurudev's name working now how many times we have heard from pujya guruji this statement and that all through you know i am also seeing yes 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 reaffirming reconfirming the truth of it it also behoves of all of us pujya gurudev devotees that we keep at it that credibility of our organization is furthered further and further in our generation through so that the next generation reaps the benefits of that chinmaya right so that is one more point i would like to share then then one more point huh hmm what how would i say how do i say that sometimes you know i come across statements like this i say for for gurudev there was swami tapovan ji there was swami shivanand ji for us who is there when i hear that i say what what are you talking sometimes you know i feel this is the most silly statement anyone can ever utter because we are not understanding what pooja gurudev has done for us remember we always chant this is it not सदा शिव समारंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमा अस्मदाचार्य पर्यंता वंदे गुरु परंपरा पूज्य गुरुदेव वाज नॉट जस्ट अ पर्सन यू नो जस्ट एन इंडिविजुअल पर्सन हु केम एंड डिड समथिंग ग्रेट एंड लाइक अ फ्लैश ऑफ लाइटनिंग केम एंड देन ब्राइटेंड एवरीथिंग एंड देन डिसअपियर नो Guruji Guruji is a continuing spiritual renaissance is a continuing persistent spiritual renaissance Gurudev's work continues will continue through the millennia You see the same Ganga ji which which starts in Himalayas not even starts in Himalayas it is said Mandakini Mandakini is Ganga ji of the heavens they say the same ganga ji at least look okay, let us say from our standpoint what we see ganga ji starting from the himalayas 
and then she goes ganga from gomuk then gangotri then uttarkashi then rishikesh then what haridwar it keeps going 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 finally it reaches the merges the ocean right all through from there till she reaches the ocean is it not the same ganga ji whatever be the name we call her in the different places in the same way our puja gurudev his love and compassion manifest through us through our parampara through puja guru ji through puja swami ji it continues let us take the blessings let us take in the same ganga ji which has flown perennially and which will keep guiding us till we reach our final destination to merge into that bhagwan and that ganga ji continues through our guru parampara and through this guru parampara may also may we also reach our fulfillment then there is one more thing which uh, swami swatmanand ji wants to inform uh, inform all you know inform all of us Uh, Pujya Swami ji, no? Pujya Swami Sarupanand ji wanted to start uh, an activity where all people from Mumbai can also join and participate. And uh, and every Sunday from May fifth onwards, we'll be starting uh, uh, a series of sessions. Sunday, Sunday, one one session, one session. And uh, we start with first Atma Bodha. and then we go to so atma bodha is a basics of vedanta we cover that then we go into uh, bhagavad gita chapter 2 chapter 15 and chapter 18 these are summary chapters of the bhagavad gita bhagavad gita chapter 2 is summary of vedanta summary of the bhagavad gita in prospect brahma uh, bhagavad gita chapter 18 is summary in retrospect and Brahm, and uh, bhagavad gita chapter 15 is a summary of the entire vedanta iti gukhya tamam shastram bhagavan shri krishna says okay and then we have one upanishad mundaka upanishad mundaka upanishad is one upanishad which covers the entire all aspects of vedanta in a very very precise manner so these these three these you know three three four texts we will be covering so it's it's called vedanta vijnana course okay please all of you feel you know you are most welcome please join and if as you are all in bombay you can come over here even if it is not possible to join for example on on site you can join online and you are all welcome let us uh, enjoy learn grow more evolve share and feel blessed boliye shri sadguru nath maharaj ki jai